In terms of breaking through the glass ceiling in a male-dominated industry, I think that you'll hear a common theme from all of the women who are speaking today, and that is really proving yourself through your work. Um, you need to generate the results in order to, to maintain the position. Getting there can be a little bit different. Uh, for me, I work in my family's business, so I was provided the opportunities, uh, the initial opportunities anyway, by my family. Um, but then I went on to become the first ever woman to run our live events division, our uh, talent relations division, our talent brand management division, our digital business, and all of our creative writing. So it was... Um, it was a steep hill to climb, but again, you, you get the opportunity and then you just have to keep proving yourself and believe in yourself. I think one of the biggest obstacles I had to overcome as an entrepreneur was really convincing some of the people closest to me that I was serious and I knew what I wanted to do and that I was going to be able to achieve it. Yeah, I think one of the, one of the biggest obstacles I had to overcome was convincing myself that I was worthy of the dream that I had set out for myself and that I was actually capable um, of achieving it as well. I really would like to tell anybody else that wants to do something like this that your dreams are of value, but make sure that there isn't a single doubt in your mind that this is what you want to do. Otherwise, you're not going to be able to make it through such a difficult journey. So we're quite unique uh, in the fact that we are three shareholders and business owners that are women. Uh, within the organization. We don't have any siblings that are male. So we've been quite um, you know, unique in that way, very special, um, where we kind of really, we do get on and it's really been quite, uh, it's very harmonious and everyone gets on in that way. However, when I first did uh, work in the family business, it was quite uh, difficult to penetrate uh, the conventional, traditional managers that had their set ways and so um, it took me a couple of years to really kind of break through that barrier. And particularly as a young woman, marketing, advertising, I had a lot of an innovative and creative ideas that I wanted to push forward. My advice really would be to um, prove yourself through your work. Um, the results of your work will prove to the people that sort of are, are challenging you. Um, you know, what your skill sets are, what you can bring to the table. It might take some time, uh, but it's really important to stick through those times and really prove it through your, the results of what you're doing.